Hey guys, this is Ian and in today's episode we're gonna do a quick DIY project and in today's episode we're going to paint the spare tire holder on my 1997 RAV4 which is right here. Uh, if you notice the uh, tire holder itself is actually starting to uh, fade here um, actually starting to rust also so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go ahead and paint it with the plastic dip right here uh, I got this from uh, Amazon so I'll link the description below but basically this is actually a uh, removable uh, paint so just in case you don't like the, the color you could always remove it it's not as permanent as other paint it's very forgiving actually so that is what we're gonna use uh, for supplies other than the plastic dip which is right here we're gonna use a, a tape and the reason why we're gonna use the tape for is we're gonna tape this screw right here so we don't want any paint to go onto those treads right here that would make it difficult to tread the nuts on it for the tire so we're gonna do that right now so we're covering each of the uh, bolt so basically you you want to cover whatever you don't want to paint so that's the general rule um, so we call it masking so after masking all the bolts uh, or anything that you don't want to get painted on uh, the next step would be to make sure that you have an adequate ventilated um, location for painting and of course here it's good because we're outside so we're gonna go ahead and set up our painting booth and we're gonna start painting before you actually want to spray you just want to go ahead and you know just do a quick check all right guys so we finished the first layer um it does look a little bit better than before but we still have um, a couple more layers um, at least a minimum of five the reason why being is just in case you do decide to remove it uh, since this is a rubber paint the more layer you have the more it's easier to remove so the ideal waiting time or curing time for this particular paint depending on the temperature outside if it's hot 15 to 20 minutes uh, if it's cold um, a little bit longer than that so We'll give it 15 to, uh, 15 to 20 minutes and we'll come back and hit it again. Welcome back guys, this is Ian and we're here to show you the uh, final product of our paint. Uh, we pretty much finished the six coating in the front and also in the back and definitely it's much better than before. So that finish up our project right here. Let me go ahead and preview you the next project which is right here. And yes, we are going to paint it as well. So if you are interested in seeing that video, don't forget to like. Subscribe for future video. You guys have a nice day. Bye.